what is going on youtube mr 1t back with another video you guys um so if you guys didn't already be sure to check out my most recent video um that i uploaded on tuesday december 7th i uploaded it kind of early in the morning i didn't realize it was such a big file and i just had a lot to talk about um but i didn't really talk a whole lot about everything i didn't really talk about what we're gonna do in the future and stuff like that um so before we get started though you guys i want to add something to the background as you can see we don't really have anything up um if you guys have been following me on instagram and you've been watching my recent live box breaks i've been doing on instagram the last few weeks then you probably already saw it but if you didn't you guys i broke not too long ago a Japanese Team Magma vs. Aqua first edition booster box, you guys. And in the live stream when we sold all the packs, um, I went first so that way I could show everybody the pack trick and uh, to prove to everyone that you were guaranteed a holographic card or EX in each pack. That's why I, I kind of like the Japanese set over the english because you're always guaranteed to get something instead of spending hundreds and getting nothing i mean maybe like a reverse card but nothing crazier than that so we opened up the first pack you guys and oh my goodness the first pack i managed to pull this ex suicune actually you know what i'm gonna try and see if i can uh squeeze the clip in of me pulling that um so let me see hold on real quick Everything looks kind of warped, so I think I think that's what it's called. Merci et toi. Ah, c'est vous play. Rob, I will be in Paris for New Year's, so that'd be cool, man. Maybe I can meet you. We got a warp point. This looks like I believe this card is called Team Aqua's Technical Cube or something like that. It's a cube shape. I I think that's what it's called, Technical Cube. We're coming up on the rare already. Oh my goodness, you guys. So this is what I'm talking about. Like, these are so beautiful. You can almost maybe see a swirl. I think there's a swirl right there. The swirl right there. So that is pretty epic, you guys. And then we are guaranteed another rare hollow behind here. Or an EX card. So... Here we go, you guys. Are you ready for the first holo of the pack of this box break? What are we going to get? Three. Oh, we still have a few cards left, though. Three, two, one. Ooh, okay. This is our regular rare. Um, okay, so I don't know if I did the card trick wrong, but there should still be a uh, holographic card behind here. We got a uh, Surviper regular rare. And then our final card is, oh my god, <laughs> no way, <laughs> oh my god, what the hell, what in the world, dude, we just first pack magic, I guess, oh my god, you guys, this is what I'm talking about right here, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed that little uh, clip of me pulling the Suicune EX out of the first booster pack, you guys. And I sent it in to PSA, and I got it express graded, super express graded. Uh, and it came back a gem mint 10. So let's go ahead and put that Suicune in the bag, you guys. And if you remember from long ago when I did the PSA returns video, then you guys already know that we scored a super low population Suicune hollow from Neo Revelations. Got a gem mint 10. Only 13 exist in the world. So let's just go ahead and put them next to the other Suicune, you guys. Um, and then if you continued watching that same live where we got that Suicune EX, you will know that we managed to pull ourselves a, another Gold Star card. Oh my goodness. that has that this, this Gold Star that we pulled, it's a duplicate Gold Star from another set that I pulled the same exact Gold Star. Not too long ago, actually. Um, but this one looked a lot better. Here's the back of it. Maybe like a small white dot in the bottom left corner. Very, very, very minimal damage. Uh, but here it is, you guys. We got the Latias Gold Star from EX Deoxys. And I think I can actually share the clip right now. 
we have two more so let us just try our luck ex deoxys you guys ex deoxys you guys only nine cards in this booster pack holy chicken on a stick you know what i'm gonna do the card trick for old time's sake I have pulled a Gold Star Latias from this set. So let's see if we can get something crazy. I haven't opened up EX in a minute. No, I never graded the Latias. I just never really had time. Also, it had like some print lines on it. So I was just like, you know what? Like it's at best going to get like an eight. So right, it's just not worth it to me right now. Um, but it looks beautiful in a binder. So all right, you guys, we have Meteor Falls. Can y'all see that? Only 107 cards. Holy chicken on a stick, you guys. Okay. Even if we don't get anything, you guys, we're not opening up any other packs. Like, I opened up... This is my third pack open. So, this is this is it right here. We got a Minin. Whew, here we go. We got Slugma. Only nine cards in this freaking pack. Come on. Slugma. Let's get a reverse rare at least. That would be sick. Uh, Surskit. Got a Wingle. Yeah, Germany sucks to ship to. I mean, it's not too bad. It's just a waiting period. Um, no, I haven't been able to find any Fusion Strike. I mean, I haven't really tried to find anything, but we got a Magikarp. What is that? One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so we got one more card behind here and then our reverse. Yo, that is such a dope card. Shroomish. Chillin. I like the uh, art in the background. All right, so our reverse is going to be... Oh, dude, we got a low tad reverse. Just a common card. Fuck. With like a print line going down here. Jesus, man. All right, here we go. Come on. On the rare. Can we get a rare hollow at least, bro? Come on. This would be so hype right now. Oh! Oh! <laughs> what bro oh my god <laughs> holy chicken holy chicken on a stick bro oh my god oh my god oh my god oh my goodness holy shit bro i was not expecting that no freaking way no freaking way no freaking way. No freaking way. Dude, this one is so much better than the other one. Oh. Oh my god. Oh. Oh my goodness gracious. Holy chicken on a stick. Oh my god, look at that swirl. Dude. What? This is the second time. Why couldn't it be a Rayquaza? Holy chicken on a stick. Yo. So yeah, you guys, at the end of the live stream, I was like, you know what? Let's open up an EX pack. I'm down. And we opened up one of my Deoxys packs. I had a duplicate, so I was like, I can spare one. And I'll just keep the other one for my collection goal. Look at that double swirl action. That is nuts. But we only got a nine, but that's totally fine with me, you guys. So these are the the beautiful highlight for the background of the video. And then I bought this one. It's a PSA 6. I bought it um, maybe like two, two and a half years ago. I got it for $700. Two and a half years ago. So I was like, man, that looks really cool. And I don't know if I would ever get a chance to pull one of these. And uh, <laughs> I've been pulling them left and right, you guys. I mean... I've pulled two, I graded one myself, and I purchased one, so I have three Latias Gold Stars, which is bonkers, if you ask me. But yeah, it'd be nice if I ever get a chance to open up some more Deoxys packs in the future, then, um, yeah, hopefully we can get another one, like a different, different Gold Star. But um, if you guys don't follow me on Instagram, we are currently doing a box break of this Japanese Diamond and Pearl Moonlight Moonlit Pursuit. It is a two set, two subset of one 
a majestic dawn in english so in this half we have the chrysalia level x haunch crow level x and an exclusive japanese only guard chomp level x so we have packs here uh they're 200 to have it opened up live or we could open it here on youtube or 215 dollars if you want to get it shipped sealed to you so here we have so many packs you guys i think we have like 10 packs or so so i don't think i will be opening any for my personal self um so yeah these are for you guys if you guys want to pick them up but i have gotten so much better at not ripping every single pack that i see because that used to be the biggest problem i had i would just rip open everything but now i kind of want to collect sealed packs and that's kind of the whole this is that's the whole point of this you know like look at this we completed uh we, don't, we haven't really touched wizards of the coast um ex packs the same uh, we got uh, Power Keepers and then Diamond and Pearl. So in today's video, you guys, I'm actually going to share with you guys. Where did I write it? Oh, here. I wrote it here on this box. I wanted to show you guys some more packs. And I got more Pokemon packs. Yay. So we have a package right here. And look at this goofball. Ho, ho, ho. Merry Christmas. Oh, man. What a, what a beautiful man right here. So, um... Yes, we got a beautiful package, just kind of like an early Christmas gift, I guess. So we'll just open it right here, you guys. Obviously, I got some more packs for uh, the collection log that I have here. Um, so we'll just start off with this. Maybe we'll start off with the big one. So let me get some scissors real quick. Okay, I'll be very extra careful with this right here. Um, so yeah, you guys, so... In the last video that I shared, the, the first stuff, I showed you guys we got a bunch of diamond and pearl packs, black and white sets, and um, what's it called? We got some uh, Call of Legends, Heart Gold, Soul Silver sets. So I was like, you know what? Like, I kind of want to try to complete as much as I can before the new year, since the year is almost over. And I am going on vacation in a few weeks. I'll be going to Europe. Um, I'll be in Paris, France for New Year's Eve. So that'll be really cool. Um, but I was like, oh my goodness, like, let me try and get some other sets. So what I'm about to show you guys is going to be the complete Sun and Moon era, as well as X and Y. So let us start off with the newest to oldest right here, you guys. From, from the packs and sets that I was missing, we have one Guardians Rising booster pack. We got a Crimson Invasion from Sun and Moon. We got the Sun and Moon Forbidden Light booster pack. We have an Ultra Prism, very nice Leafeon. We got the Lost Thunder with Glacephalon. And we got the Team Up, can't forget this one. This one's actually a really popular set. It's actually one of like the more expensive Sun and Moon sets as well as Cosmic Eclipse, you guys. So let us, um, before we continue and show off some other stuff, Maybe we'll open up a pack at the end. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how I'm feeling, you guys. Hopefully, you guys are doing fantastic. Um, Cosmic Eclipse, check. All right, we can put Cosmic Eclipse to the side. Dude, welcome to the team. We got Team Up. We can put him to the side. We got the Lost Thunder. Very nice. I already had a Celestial Storm, Forbidden Light, Ultra Prism, Crimson Invasion, and a Guardians Rising. Dude, that's awesome. What am I missing? Am I missing anything? Oh, no, dude, that completed it. Oh, wow. Yo, we're actually almost done. After today, I think we will be done with the whole right side. So, I mean, besides Brilliant Stars, I think that's the newest set in Japan. Um, I think it's not set to be released in the U.S. till like, February of next year. Uh, but look at this, you guys. We got Sun and Moon. Guardians Rising, Burning Shadows, Crimson Invasion, Ultra Prism, all the way down to Cosmic Eclipse. Uh, and then we have Cosmic Eclipse, then we, then we go down to Sword and Shield. So we just need a few Sword and Shield, Rebel Clash, Vivid Voltage, and I need to get a few of these packs. But you can still find these in stores, Evolving Skies and Fusion Strike, so it's not too big of a problem. And now we got to tackle on the X and Y series. So uh, we can actually fold this now. We can just fold this and have it chilling here. But okay, you guys, let's see the first X and Y pack. 
So obviously it would be X and Y base. Okay, here we go. Are y'all ready for this one? All right, <laughs> this is so cool to see. We got Roaring Skies, Ancient Origins. We got Breakthrough, and we got a Breakpoint. We got Fates Collide with the Alakazam. Steam Siege, everyone's favorite X and Y set. We got X and Y Evolutions, reprint of the base set. Phantom Forces, Primal Clash, Furious Fists, X and Y base, and the Flash Fire. Wow, he sent us the Charizard artwork too. That is beautiful, man. That's the Mega Charizard EX. Okay, so I'll grab my Sharpie really quick. Thank you guys so much for um allowing me to uh, just basically record whatever it is that I, I, I choose to and share with you guys. This has been an awesome and fun uh, collection goal of mine. Um, I never really, I mean, from, from my previous videos, you guys, Phantom Forces, Primal Clash, I never kept anything sealed. So I'm actually very, 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 very proud of myself for not going crazy every time I buy something and just ripping it open because uh, it's nice from the collector's standpoint to actually keep the product sealed, if you know what I mean. <laughs> oh my goodness, Ancient Origins and Roaring Sky. Dude, oh my gosh, this is beautiful. This is just, oh my goodness. I think we might get to open up like one pack or two packs. We'll see, because I know he sent me something and I'm gonna have like duplicates, but okay. Holy crap, you guys. All I need from the the right side is Sword and Shield, Rebel Clash, Vivid Voltage, Evolving Skies, and Fusion Strike. And from the left side, I still need Arceus and Supreme Victors. Those are the Platinum packs, the Platinum sets. And then I need a Mysterious Treasures from Diamond and Pearl. And then I just need to tackle on some EX, EX packs, which are which are kind of hard to find, but you know I'm trying my best. Uh, EX Dragon, uh, yeah, these are gonna be the difficult ones. Sky Ridge and Aquapolis, and of course I'm gonna I know I'm gonna struggle with the um, Legendary Collections. That one's gonna be difficult. I already have Neo Destiny, but. But let, let's go ahead and see. Um, let me put these to the side, you guys. Look at these booster packs. Holy chicken. Holy chicken on a stick, you guys. That is so many packs. Man, that's awesome. Holy chicken. All right. I miss you guys. I hope you guys um, are still sub to the channel. If not, it's okay. It's not a big deal. Um, I'll try and get one more video out before my trip. And then I might try and get some packs and take them with me. And maybe I'll open up packs while I'm in Europe or something. I think that'd be funny and cool to open up like a pack in front of the Eiffel Tower or something. We'll figure it out. We'll see. Or maybe I'll open up some packs on the plane. It's like a 15-hour flight. Oh, my goodness. He actually wrapped this in like wrapping paper. I did not notice that. Dude, this is awesome, man. What? What? Dude, what the heck? All right, so we have a platinum base, diamond and pearl base. Yo, we got a great encounters? Okay. Dragon Majesty Double Crisis in a Generations pack. Yo, hold up, hold up. Yo, hold on. These are like um expansion sets, subsets. Hold on. Oh my goodness, I didn't I didn't notice that. I did not even have great encounters yet. So I think this one I'm obviously I think I'm pretty sure I like paid for this one. Great encounters. Dude, that was a great encounter actually though. So we can mark that out. All we need from Diamond and Pearl is Mysterious Treasures. And then we got the Dragon Majesty, which is right there, number uh, letter E, subset. And then we got a Double Crisis, letter B, Generations for C. Oh my goodness, that's awesome. Generations, Double Crisis, Dragon Majesty. Okay, cool. That is so cool. Oh man, look at that. We got Kyogre, Dragonite, and a Pikachu. So that is awesome as well. So yes, these packs right here, I already have them. Huh, it's kind of hard to like 
decide which one to open up, platinum or diamond and pearl. I think we'll open up the diamond and pearl and just count and just pray that we can get something. I mean, it's not really a Mr. 1T video if we don't open up some vintage. Diamond and Pearl booster pack, you guys. This will wrap up today's video. I want to see if it has the date on here. Oh, this pack is old. <laughs> All right. Um, 2007. You can see that right there. Oh, this pack is dirty, dude. What? It's getting my mat dirty. All right. So... For the sake of the video, and I've started learning that uh, the quality of the cards, well, let's just do the card trick. 10 cards, so it should be maybe three to the front. If I'm not mistaken, I haven't opened up Diamond and Pearl in a minute. All right, you guys, here we go. Thank you so much for sticking around to the end of the video. Um, I think next video, I will try to share with you guys some recent EX booster packs that I was able to win in auction and um, in person. So. Yeah, I will definitely update you guys before the end of the new year, and I'll upload some videos here and there while I'm in Europe and the Middle East. So, to wrap things up, we have a Luxio. I actually have one uh, in the new Shining uh, uh, Brilliant Diamond Pokemon game on the Switch. If you guys play that, let me know in the comments down below. I'll get you guys added. We can do some trades. Got a Magnemite. Ooh, we got a Ghastly. Got the switch. Got the Rhyhorn. All right. I think we're coming up on the reverse here in a minute. Oh, we got a reverse Hoot Hoot. Got the trail of him in the snow. Oh, look at that print line. That is not good. <laughs> and then for the rare. Oh, we got a non holographic Beautifly. Chicken on a stick, you guys. We got a Hoot Hoot reverse. And this non-holographic Beautifly. It's still pretty cool. Fun to open up. Um, I know Diamond and Pearl, that's the base set from the Diamond and Pearl era. But I hope you guys enjoyed. And again, if you guys want to purchase packs, you know, I'll have an opportunity to make more videos for you guys. Um, but he, moving forward and like when the year 2022 comes, um, like if the prices continue to stay at a, like a low rate, then maybe we'll open up some vintage content here and there. But um, I'm probably going to try to not open up, you know, EX packs every video. Because uh, I've opened up plenty, like more. I've, I've, I've opened up an, a lot, like a lot. If you guys really want to see some EX videos, just go watch from the beginning of my channel. Like there is over 100. So, um, yeah, but maybe like special occasions or something like that or... Uh, if I somehow manage to get like a vintage box, I might open it all just for myself and just do like a massive box break uh, of me opening up the packs in like one uncut, unedited video. I think that would be really cool. Um, but we'll see. We'll see. I don't know. Like that's that that's what I will do if I could get my hands on that. I would open that and just release the whole video. But until then, I, I want to finish my current goal, which is to complete this entire list. Uh, I still need some subsets and then uh, just a few different sets of packs from each different era, like uh, a few Wizards of the Coast. That shouldn't be a problem. Maybe the e-reader e sets. Um, EX Team Rocket Returns is going to be a difficult one to get my hands on. There's only a few online and they're like 800 plus. I don't really want to do that right now. But anyways, you guys, I'm going to wrap this up right here. I'm going to go take a nap. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, give it a like. And uh, if you didn't, give it a thumbs down. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Mr. 1T, signing out. Peace.